right. It's a Friday night, and we are back again to open some more cards. Oops. Have a little fun. So hopefully we'll have some, some of the participants jump in here just in a few moments, and we will get started. Good evening, Wade. Glad you can make the stream. We'll give it another minute or two. See if anybody else pops in. Just sent a tweet out, so I'll send a... I'll post in the... Facebook group real quick too. Yeah, I uh, I figured, you know, when I kind of realized the date and time of everything, I thought, ah, oh, crap. <laughs> my my team already lost today. Uh, one nothing game against the Mets in, up in New York. Um, tough pill to swallow, but um, yeah, I figured. I figured we'd have some people watching watching some games tonight, but that's okay. They can catch the replay. Um, with this being one of these uber cheap breaks, I, um, I didn't expect to have a whole lot of traffic tonight, but, uh, hopefully that will change next week. Um, I'm probably going to, I don't know. I'm going to probably do something to maybe entice some viewership next week. Who are the, um, who are the pirates playing tonight? With work, that oh, this was this was a crappy, crappy, crappy week at work, and with everything going on, it's uh, it's been a blur. Hey, good evening, Ben. So the Pirates are playing the Cardinals. Come on, guys, you got to take out the Cardinals. I'm still, I'm still pretty livid against the Cardinals and their crap in the uh, NLDS last year. Well, at least Ben's team is one and oh. So all right. It is a few minutes after ten, so we're gonna go ahead. Hey, good evening, Royal Chief. Yeah, we're gonna go ahead and get started. Um I've got a uh I got some other things to try to do this evening, but uh, we will enjoy this. So I had not, I, I knew of this product before, but I'd never have seen the packaging, let alone packs or open packs before. And um, 
I got a really, really good deal on it. And that's one of the reasons why I did this one at two bucks a team. Um, it's basically a parallel set of 97 score, which is a pretty nice clean design already. Um, and at first I wasn't sure if there would be inserts in here, but uh, the back of the box, get it to focus. Showcase series, which are like foil parallels or one and two. Randy Johnson's Pitcher Perfect, which are kind of cool. Those are one and five. Artist Proofs, one and seven. Highlight Zone, one and nine. Franchise, one and 17. And the Glowing Franchise are one and 79. And it says the franchise cards are so thick they count as two cards. So, um, yeah, I'm still not exactly sure what we're going to get. So let's, let's get go to town. Up, Mark. Good evening. So we got these big old fat packs. Empty box. So has, it, has anybody seen this product before? Like boxes or packs at shows? I, I know some of you guys are, are able to frequent shows more often than me. In my neck of the woods, we don't get many shows anymore. Or at least that I'm able to attend. All right. Yes, no bricking. No bricking, bricking. They don't they don't feel. I mean, I don't hear any snap, crackle, or pop when I just slightly flex the pack, so fingers crossed. Is it 94 or 5? The it's like a dark blue score set. Those are notorious for bricking and just snowflaking the crap out of them. Yeah, nice and long, nice and loose. All right, so if you're not familiar with them, printed on thicker card stock, they do have this big old logo. Card back, loaded with stats, a little bit of a write up. You got fielding stats. You got your main stats, and then you've got, and then it breaks down the 1996 stats. Um, so for the picture here, you've got their win-loss record, their ERA, walks, strikes, all that stuff. Pretty, if you like, if you're a, if you're a stat junkie, this is a nice set. So starting off with uh, Ismail Valdez. John Smoltz, Mike Grace, Jose Herrera, Terrell Wade, Jose Canseco, Will Cordero, Tom Pagnazzi, Ray Durham, Kevin Apier, Danny Graves, and we got an insert right off the bat. I remember this one. Oh, this is Rodriguez. I love that. Well, it'd be better if he was reading a Marvel comic, but. So, this will, obviously, this will go to the Mariners. Reggie Jefferson, Jeff Bagwell, Jose Rosat, Rosadio, Rosado, Gary Gaetti, Chippa, Robbie Thompson, Brant Brown, 
Terry Steinbach, Raul Casanova, Chad Curtis, Alex Ochoa, Michael Tucker, Raphael. I'm not sure. <laughs> Raul Mondi, uh, uh, Mondesi, Dennis Eckersley, Dax Jones, Curtis Pride, and Jason Giambi. Nah, buddy, you got, you got it all wrong. Marvel Trump's DC. Come on. Come on. But then again. <sighs> yeah. Um, when I was building my Ray Ordonez uh, PC, this set did confuse me between the, the private stock and then series two. They didn't call it private stock. They called it um, like reserve collection or something like that. Um so trying to, yeah, it was confusing. It wasn't until just recently that I kind of finally figured it all out. Images where that these days. Now, I can't argue. I've, I've been enjoying more independent books that I've picked up, um, you know, outside of the superhero realm. Uh, I've been enjoying some different, different things from boom and from, um, and from image. All right, second pack. We have started off with uh, Roger Clemens, Orlando Miller, Nero Rodriguez, Jeffrey Hammonds, Mark Johnson. I could sit here and talk comics with Mark all night long. Mike Sweeney, Mark McLemore, Ben McDonald, Matt Williams, Tom Gordon, Ella Ellis Burks. It's a good shot. And we got, ooh, nice. I've not seen this insert set before. Highlight Zone. Mike Piazza. So, it's always cool to get a shiny card. We all like shiny cards, right? Juan Guzman, Andrew, Darren Dreifert, John Valentine, Marvin Bernard, Lyle Mouton, Greg Jeffries, Sandy Alomar Jr., Ricky Vitalico, Butch Husky, Mike Stanley, Hal Morris, Jim Tomei, <laughs> the logo is clear right over that red player, right over his head. <laughs> Roberto Hernandez. Albert Bell, don't call me Joey. Chris Hoyles. David Cohn. And Jay Bell. Yeah, this... this this is going to make people stacks even fatter than before. There's a lot of cards. Right. Tim Salmon starting off. Not too bad. Billy Wagner. Sammy Sosa. There you go, Ben. Rick Aguilera. Will Clark. James Mouton. Randy Johnson. Edgar Martinez. Fernando Valenzuela. Kenny Lofton. Sean Barry. And we got an upside down Royals card of Johnny Damon. And it is the Showcase series, which is 
this is the normal parallel. These are also found in regular score packs. It's funny because I know you probably can't tell, but this is your standard stock. It's not, uh, it's not the, it's not the thicker stock. These are a little prone to fingerprints, so I'll sleeve that bad boy up. Oh, thanks. Thanks for that info, Mark. I, I uh, Mark said, according to Baseball Cardpedia, the inserts and parallels were spread out uh, through score, premium stock, and hobby reserve equally. So I guess that makes sense because the picture perfect that we first got is it's the same card. Nothing different about that. All right, next up, we've got uh, Al Martin, Eric Young, Brian Jordan, Sean Estes, Mike Mussina, Geronimo Barroa, Andy Fox, Delino DeShields, Ken Hill, Jeff Conan, Mike Lansing, Darren Bragg, Greg Vaughn, Barry Bonds, Trey Beeman, Wilson Alvarez, Alan Trammell, and we've got a common checklist with Paul Molitor on the front. Yeah, I, I like this year of score. Regardless, I I, I think it's a uh, think it's a nice set, nice clean design. All right, here's my man Ray Ordonez. Chan Ho Park, Jason Kendall, Paul Molitor, Al Leiter, Charles Johnson. Rico Brogna, Todd Green, Mark Lemke, Mark Lewis, and Artist Proof, Ellis Burks for the Rockies. Who got the Rockies? Let me check real quick. I didn't print my list out like I normally do. I apologize. I got sucked into watching SmackDown, watching the bar fight. <laughs> I didn't jump on the computer until just right before the break. Jared. Jared got the Rockies. Greg Maddox, Frank Rodriguez, We've got a chase checklist, and I know that uh, I know that player for the uh, Mets. I can't think of his name right now. I'm gonna say Bob, is it Bobby Jones, I think. Richard Marl, Jose Rosado, Dan Wilson, James Baldwin. Jeff D'Amico. How I say that, Ben? Did I did I pronounce his last name right? Probably not. Omar Vizcal, Trevor Hoffman, Ramon Martinez, Darren Oliver. Oh, old throwback. John Jaha, Carlos Garcia, Travis Fryman, Carlos Delgado. Uh, Mac Suzuki and John Burkett. All 
Yeah, I uh, I got a love hate relationship with WWE. I still watch it though. Usually, I'm it's more background noise. I'm usually doing something else while wrestling's on these days. But I gotta say, collecting wrestling cards with my daughter has turned has actually been a lot of fun. She uh. I uh, attribute getting back into collecting some wrestling cards to her. It's been fun to share something to share together. All right. We do have something here in the middle. So let me see if I can slide it to the back so we don't spoil it. Come on. Oh, we got two somethings. All right. Roger Pavlik, Rob Nen, Alex Gonzalez, Ruben Sierra, Kevin Tapini, Vinny Castilla, Andy Pettit, FP Santangelo, Manny Ramirez, Darren Dalton, Mark Newfield, Shane Reynolds, Fred McGriff, Crime Dog, Keith Lockhart, Ed Sprague, Robin Jennings, Tony Phillips, Brian Hunter, Mike Piazza, Ken Hill, Jayhawk Owens, Mark Langston, Roger Cedeno, Alan Benez, Tony Graffinino, Kevin Seitzer, Brett Butler, and we have another showcase series, Mark McGuire. Centering is not the greatest. And yes, these are very fingerprint prone. And our last card in the pack, boom, franchise. I don't think this is the glow in the dark version. If my memory serves me correctly, the name and the threads here, the embossed threads are um, kind of a, I don't know. You can tell that you can tell it's the glow in the dark. It's it's you know it's got a it's got a uh, like a sandpaper texture. I think the score logo as well. But yeah, nice. All right, so half halfway through the box, and I already got a nice little selection of. Insert some parallels. Royal Chief. I am Flywheels on uh, Trading Card Database. Um, I've uploaded some of my want list, but I too have some extras that I need to upload to my uh, trade list as well. So, yeah, if, if you know somebody who's willing to trade... Um, either wrestling for wrestling or, you know, or wrestling for baseball or whatever. I mean, I, I've got quite a bit uploaded and, and I'll gladly trade for, for uh, cards to uh, complete some sets that I'm building. So yeah, please hit me up flywheels on the uh, trading card database. Next up, we have Jeff Supon, Raul Ibenez, Ibenez, Jerm, uh, Jermaine Dye, Chad, Matola, Jimmy Haynes, Leo Gomez, Chris Basio, Robert Perez, Gary Sheffield, Eric Davis, Wade Boggs, and 
Hey, we got an eBay one of one. Check this out. <laughs> what well, is a Tom Agnazi artist proof? But it's got. We had a piece of a card, I guess, cut stuck on it. Uh, doesn't look like it's damaged though. Try to fan those out a little bit. So that's our second artist proof. I think Perez was missing the foil. <clears throat> was that one that we just went through? Oh, yeah. Check that out. Good eyes, uh, Paul. It's the, the, it was, the card was stamped. You can see the impression. If I get it in the light the right way. <coughs> Excuse me. There we go. You can see the impression there. And there's just a little bit of gold. <laughs> That's an eBay one of one. Karim Garcia, Mark Carrion, Javi Lopez, Common Checklist featuring Eddie Murray, Greg Gagne, Scott Stoviat, Dwight Gooden. Danny Tartable, John Burke, Hideo Nomo, Rusty Greer, David Wells, Dave Nielsen, Johnny Damon, Ralph Millard, there's the base, McGuire, Jack McDowell, and wow, A R Q U I M E D E Z. Pozo. <laughs> That's a new one for me. Royce Clayton, Randy Myers, Jeff Cirillo, George Williams, Rafael Palmero. John Wasden, Ronnie Gant, Wally Joyner, oops, Drop Jeter, Joe Carter, George Arias, and we got another picture perfect. Why not have another comic book reading insert? And it's funny, look at the ad on the back of this issue of Adventures of Superman. There's an ad for cards, apparently, some kind of DC trading cards inserted in Eskimo pie ice cream and some kind of Welch's product. Cool taste, hot cards, great stuff. <laughs> All right. Second half of the pack, Sterling Hitchcock, Gary Gaetti, Yamil Benitez, The Fry, Brady Anderson, Damon Mashore, Andy Ashby, Reggie Sanders, Jeff Kent, Brett Boone, Sean Green, Jay Buner, Tino Martinez, Eric Karos, Marcus Jensen, Ken Caminiti, oh, seeing double, and Alex Fernandez. Three packs. Uh, Dennis Martinez, Sal Fasano. Jason Thompson, 
BJ Serhoff, Ryan Sandberg, Kimira Barty, Pat Listash, Justin Thompson, Cal Ripken, Marty Cordova, Paul Sorrento, and we got a, another showcase series. Marcus Jensen for the Giants. Okay, come on, sleeve. Jeez. Edgar Renteria, Pat Hinken. Yeah, unfortunately, some of these in the back of the pack are just not cut very good. Bob Wells, Kevin Ritz. Mark Thompson, Mark Newfield, Bobby Bow, Jeff Conan, Greg Colbrun, Desi Relliford, Tim Nairing, Mo Vaughn, Scott Brocious, Wendell McGee, Mark Witten, Bernard Gilkey, Jamie Wright, and Mickey. Tettleton. Tyler Houston for the Cubs. He was a former first round draft pick by the Braves. Tony Clark. Darren Erstad, Craig Biggio, Sandman, Mariano Rivera, Jeff King, Henry Rodriguez, Vinny Castilla, Andy Pettit, F.P. Santangelo, Manny Ramirez, Showcase Series, Dax Jones for the Giants. Shane Reynolds. Fred McGriff. Keith Lockhart. Ed Sprague. Ozzie Guillen. Pete Incavilia. Omar Vizquel. Robin Jennings. Tony Phillips. Brian Hunter, Mike Piazza, Ron Karkovice, Ruben Riviera, Mark Langston, Roger Cedeno, Alan Benes, Tony Graffinino, Kevin Seitzer, and Brett Butler. Last pack. So we've We've hit all the advertised inserts and parallels with the exception of the glow in the dark franchise. So we'll see what this last pack yields. Starting off with Mark Wohlers, Kenny Rogers, Robin Ventura, Daryl Strawberry, Bobby Higginson. Armando Reynoso, James Mouton, Randy Johnson, Edgar Martinez, Fernando Valenzuela, Kenny Lofton, Sean Barry. This one's got a little nick on the back right there. 
Showcase series, Raul Mondesi for the Dodgers. I didn't, I didn't catch much of the game last night that I want that I wanted to, but man, I have a feeling the Dodgers are going to be scary good this year. Eric Young, Brian Jordan, Sean Estes, Mike Mussina, Geronimo Barroa, Tony Gwynn. Andy Fox, Delano DeShields, Ken Hill, Jayhawk Owens, Mark Grace, Alan Watson, Greg Vaughn, Barry Bonds, Trey Beeman, Wilson Alvarez, Alan Trammell, and a Paul Molitor checklist. Finishes up our box. So, kind of short and sweet this weekend, though the sorting will not be short and sweet for me. I will get that started and underway this weekend, and I'll throw up a quick recap post. But let's do a recap real quick of some of the goodies. So we have some of the parallels, uh, the showcase series. We have Marcus Jensen, Raul Mondesi, Dax Jones, Mark McGuire, and a Johnny Damon. And then we had the Artist Proof Parallels, Tom Pagnazzi and Ellis Burks. We have this uh, Highlight Zone Piazza, Pitcher Perfect. We got Alex Rodriguez and Cal Ripken, which is kind of funny since they're both pictured on only the back of each other's cards. And then we got the franchise, Frank Thomas. All right, guys. Thank you. This was a short break. This was more or less, hopefully, to try to get some new guys, get their feet wet. I know we had a lot of people join last week to the Facebook group. Um, though I do have another one of these really cheap breaks planned um, for the near future. Um, what's up next? I'm glad you asked. Let me grab it. All right. Um, next week's going to be two boxes, two sports. People have been asking for some football. So we're going to do some football. We're going to do 1999 Collector's Edge first place football. Um, I might have a card or two from this set and in, um, in my collection and my Panthers, Carolina Panthers collection. But uh, these are, uh, these have um, Excalibur cross branded inserts. It says average of one autograph card per bat, uh, per box. They're short printed rookies. Um, there are several parallels. Gold ingot are one and one galvanized. Those are numbered um, 500 for veterans and 100 for rookies. Hollow gold parallels, which are again numbered 50 for veterans and 10 for rookies. Pro signature authentic are one in 24. Successors one in 12. Adrenaline number to a thousand. Excalibur. 1 in 24, Loud and Proud, 1 in 12, Future Legends, 1 in 6, Rookie Signature Game Gear, 10 cards, Jersey Signed Ball, Signed Jersey and Ball Cards, numbered 500 for balls and 100 for jerseys. So, yeah, um, I know Collector's Edge was a little weird, but, uh, but yeah, I'm looking forward to that. And if this goes over well, guys, I've We'll do. We'll keep doing some football uh, as long as I can find good deals. And if if y'all like the collector's edge, I might be able to get some more. And then for baseball, we're gonna do a box of one of my favorite um, companies, and that would be Pacific. I love Pacific. I little biased because they chose, you know, they, they put my guy back in the day, Ray Adonias and, and, and everything. But, um, I love Pacific. I love their innovation. I love, um, their designs. 99 crown 
uh, but crown collection is not, it's not my favorite design. Um, but, uh, but yeah, this is, um, I was super, I was super happy to find this. It's a 300 card set and we've got plenty of inserts to chase. There's platinum blue parallels, one in 73, uh, Latinos of the major leagues, two and 37, um, team checklist, which I'm sure our die cut are one in 37, Tape measure laser cuts. Oh man, I hope we pull one of those. One in 73. In the cage laser cuts, one in 145. Those are beautiful. And Pacific Cup, one in 721. I'm not even sure what those look like. So, <laughs> yep. Um, you can't claim your team yet, guys, but. I will get these. Um, I will get these posted. The signups. Uh, I will get those posted on Sunday. And as I've been doing for the last several weeks, I'll try to get these things posted um, before twelve o'clock or sometime um, before twelve noon on Sunday. So uh, definitely keep your eye. Uh, definitely keep your eye open for those if you are looking to join. There will be, you know, a sign up for each product. That way, you know. I'm sure there's some people that want to do football and not baseball and vice versa. If you want to do both, that's great. So that's on par for next week. Um, and I'll keep my eyes open for, for more stuff, but thanks again, guys. Uh, Y'all have a great weekend and uh, look for a recap post. Look for the signups on Sunday and I will catch you guys in the next video. Y'all have a great evening.